cool party people and welcome to the vlog it is not super early it's just after 10 uh the vlog is just exporting i got up probably at just after nine and it's crazy to think that nine o'clock is a three hour sleep in like what the heck that's insane i'm a bit stuff snuffily this morning and i don't like that so i'm wondering if i'm getting sick i hope not body still hurts a little bit today but not as much as yesterday so that is a win and I've been puttering a bit while I've been editing and like while it's rendering and stuff trying to figure out what I'm gonna get done today because with D&D &D, like four o'clock so it's 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, it's like six hours. In six hours I'm basically occupied for six hours so I really need to prioritize the things that I want to do today so for one Japanese study because we talked about it yesterday. It is a daily commitment, so I need to get that done and um, It'd be great to get my 5,000 words done before I go to again It's not as much of a priority because that is a monthly goal and after yesterday I think I'm closer to 8,000 words ahead Is that how that works? Yeah, yeah something like that So I'm not too concerned, but still it would be nice to get it done So again, I can save those extra words for the days when I just don't wanna. Currently exporting, I should make a thumbnail. I'm just not, I wasn't motivated about naming this vlog today, so hopefully I'll come up with a better solution when I actually go to upload it, and I just wasn't feeling any screenshots to make a thumbnail out of, so we're just, we're just not feeling it this morning. I did sleep pretty well, but I'm also kind of like, because I slept really quite better than usual. I'm gonna start moving here soon, because I should probably have breakfast or something and then we'll go from there yeah <laughs> I just I just, I just I yeah we're not with it yet I'm awake but I'm not awake you know <laughs> I'm just gonna I'm gonna stop I'm gonna go now because it's I'm just gonna keep doing this alrighty so I'm making some progress my voice is kind of not there I'm cooking food right now it's um just about it's like 10 to 11 i don't know why i go just about 11 but it is clearly 10 to 11 and um so my food should be done just after 11 which is exciting i'm very cozy in my pajamas with this lovely card again my vlog is just about uploading upload it it has about a minute left and they'll have to process so that is good it's only you know like <laughs> Eight, nine, ten, eleven. It's like three hours behind, but considering I slept in for three extra hours, it makes sense. So that's where I'm at. I'm gonna have my lunch, and then I'm going to take care of getting my room in order because even though it's not that messy, it really feels like it. And then once I get that organized, then I'll feel better about things. Sorry if the lighting's bad. I don't have my desk light on. And um, yeah, once I get that sorted, then I'm gonna just go to town, try to get my Japanese done right away, and then a few other things. I don't have too, too much to do. Most of it is just tidying and cleaning my room today, which is nice because I don't really have a lot of time. Okay, so I'm now nice and fed, and as you can see, everything's clean. I even cleaned up this area right here beside my desk, which is where my embroidery stuff normally is. It was a disaster. And so now it is time for Nihongo o Benkyo Shimas. And um, yeah, so we're gonna do that and then hopefully get into some editing. I'm feeling really good. It is only, is doing it, it is 10 to 12. I was gonna say, it's, it's pretty much 12. No, it's 10 to 12, stop doing that. You're losing 10 minutes, 10 minutes are important. Uh, so I'm going to do this, and then I should have time easily to do my editing, write a blog post. Eventually I should switch over to these, because I much prefer the sound clarity, but I prefer the ease of <laughs> the shotgun mic. I actually want to film a video about my pros and cons with the tech that I use, so I'll do that at some point. But for now, we just too busy, <laughs> so I'm going to do this now. And then I'll probably get dressed because I'm still in my jammies, but honestly, I'm so comfy. I don't want to change, uh, but I will get changed here soon and try to look presentable for D&D because, like, I don't even know. I never know with my hair, honestly. We went for it. <laughs> I'm, like, trying to do my hair in, like, any style because normally I just, like, ponytail it or bun it. And I saw Blake Lively in an interview yesterday, and she had, like, this really cute, like, whoosh, and a foop, and lulup. 
technical terms. And it looked so good. And I basically recreated it, but it does not look so good. Because I prob it's probably because I don't have a stylus. Um, yeah. Anyways. We went a little crazy with the eye makeup today. Because why not? Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> and, um... Yeah, I'm doing pretty good for getting stuff done. It's pouring rain outside, so I don't want to take out my garbage, so I'm not going to do that. Like, it's so close. It's, like, maybe 50 feet there. <laughs> but I'm just very lazy, so I'm not going to take it out. I'm not going to take my recycling out either, because it's right beside there, so that's fine for now. So really, I just have... The most important thing to do for me today is to edit those 5,000 words. It is quarter to two. My friend is picking me up at quarter after four, so I have plenty of time to do this, so I just need to stop being such a lazy slug. I'm also trying to decide if I want to snack on something before I go to D&D, &D, and then not snack at D&D, &D, or not snack now and snack there. Because I always feel like I eat way too much on Fridays, because it's just there's just, there's snacks. There are snacks. There are so many snacks, but... We shall see, and as promised, I am wearing the same sweater that I've worn for like the last three days. In all fairness, I've just gone home and put it on. <laughs> I don't think I've really left the house after. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I haven't left the house other than for work in a couple days now, so it's fine. Anyways, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get this done, and then maybe I'll embroider if I have time, or maybe I'll play some video games. I don't know. I don't know. We'll do something. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> it is still raining so hard outside. It's like just pounding on the window. Anyway, it is currently a quarter to three and I just finished my editing. So my goal for every day is 5,000 words, but I've kind of just been going under the two chapter policy because they're each about, I have hair somewhere here and it's really annoying. There it is. <laughs> they're each about 2,000-ish, 2,500 words each or they balance out to make about 5,000 words. Today, however, my first chapter was about 3,000 and something, and the second one was around 7,000. It's like this one chapter that's just really long, and I've tried to split it up, but it just flows really well, and it doesn't feel long when you're reading it, so it's fine. But that means my total for today was just over 10,000 words, which is definitely a record. Before this, it was 6,928, so we significantly beat that. But I also did an interesting thing where I cut just over 8,000 words out of this book. So if you remember, I don't know, last month, maybe, I think it was last month, I was working on adding chapters in that I felt I needed. Well, basically the three chapters that I added in in this area, I was like, you know what? No. And I cut them. I did not delete them. I put them in a different file. So I do have them in case I decide that I do want them later. But for now, I think it's probably going to flow better. It just, it, like I mentioned before, it felt like it was dragging. It didn't really fit with the character's normal choices she would make. So, yeah. Anyways, we'll see if it makes it better or if it makes it worse or if I just add it back in later. I don't know. But I am now going to spend a little bit of time reading because I still have about an hour and a half before I leave for D&D. &D. And I didn't put that on my list today. I, like... I don't know, but I will finish Crest today and potentially start on Winter, which is exciting because I definitely know that I haven't read Winter. Still not 100% sure about Crest. Like, every day I'm like, oh no, I didn't read this, and the next day I'm like, oh wait, I did read this, so I don't know, but feeling pretty good about things. Pretty much done everything on my list that I can do today slash want to do. I don't want to get wet, that's fine. Um, so yeah, we're doing all right, and like, I slept so well last night. I feel human. It's amazing. <laughs> So yeah, I'm gonna go now though and um, get nice and cozy in my bed with my blanket and um, do some reading. I couldn't wait. I'm hungry now, so I'm snacking on some shredded chicken. And I've made shredded chicken a few times, but this is by far the most delicious batch I've made, and so hopefully I can replicate that again next time. It is currently quarter to four, so I'm just slowly getting stuff together. I just finished reading Cress. And once more when I got to the end, just before the end, I was like, oh yeah, I've definitely read this. And then at the very end, I was like, did I though? <laughs> so I have no idea. Anyway, there's no question about winter. I know I haven't. I'll start reading it tomorrow probably at this point because I could read now, but I feel like I have a lot of stuff to do, like fill out this birthday card. I've been being 
so good and bringing birthday cards to everybody since about November that has had birthdays and this is the last birthday now in our friend group so I'm good I don't have to remember anymore almost forgot that I was like oh that'd be so terrible to get everybody but that last person so that's what we're doing and yeah I'm just gonna probably watch some YouTube drink some water because I have a bit of a headache and I think it's because I'm not super hydrated today have my snack and then hopefully be ready to go I'm pretty much ready to go I just need to put on a rain jacket because it's pouring outside and bring my water bottle with me because gotta drink that water and hydrate uh, it means I have to pee so much but it's fine <laughs> anyways that's where we're at at this point now I'd say I'll probably just check in with you after D&D &D. so see you then I think Saturdays are generally the hardest for me because after a Friday night of D&D &D, like I just got home and it's quarter to 11 and I'm clearly not ready for bed I'm still in my jacket <laughs> So, yeah, I think tomorrow's gonna be a little rough. Gotta get up at 6, because I gotta get my vlog edited before I leave to work at 8. So that's gonna be fun. But I'm sure we'll get through. I'm gonna go start getting ready for bed, I guess. That's probably the right call. Get this up. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, I'll check in with you before I pass out. I'm not even tired and that's the problem. Alrighty, so I am in my jammies now. My makeup is off, my face is good. I kind of really liked this hair style, even though it's like, it don't look like Blake Lively, but I did get compliments on it, so that's a win. Anyway, it is 11 o'clock now, which means it's time to go to sleep because it's gonna be a long wait coming up. I have five shifts in a row and I kick it off with a split shift tomorrow and we all know how much I love split shifts <laughs> so it's just like I have to remember to pack a bag tomorrow because I think I work like 8 to 12 and then probably like 4, thir four, four o'clock to 6 or 6 30 I gotta look I've got an advance for the show so I'll know but yeah so that should be fun but I'm sure it'll be great I also need to finally stop being lazy and put these back on. It's just been nice not having to turn them on every time I film a clip, but um, I gotta get this mic back in my idiot bag and get those back where they belong. So that's where we're at. I feel like I had a pretty good and productive day, despite one, sleeping in for three hours, and two, having D&D. Like, I really organized my time well today so I think that's awesome I feel pretty good about it there's obviously things I didn't get done but it's nothing like so oh my god I can't believe I didn't do that there are some things I want to get done over the next couple days and it's mostly like figure out a monthly checklist of things I need to do each month like I have things that I need to do each month like one paying my bills I have to pay those every month and I always like I even get an email and I'm like oh yeah, yeah I should pay those and then it's like three weeks later I'm like all oh, right I should pay those so I'm just gonna put them on a checklist and I can just check it off because I like checking things off so it'll be good also one of my 2020 goals that I implemented a little bit into January was donating to a charity like 20 25 bucks every month and so I don't want to forget to do that so I want to put that on a list another one is making a new intro for my vlog for the following month don't want to fall behind on that it'll be a struggle so I just kind of want to get a list of things for every month that I want to do so like those are four things and then also stuff that I want to specifically accomplish in that month like getting my querying back on track querying four times or whatever etc I need to figure that out that's something that I want to work on over the next couple days <laughs> and like just being social like I reached out to the chef from blind channel who lives next door to me now hilariously and I was like okay life is gonna calm down for me after this week for about three weeks so let's change our plans to make plans into actual plans and let's follow through with them <laughs> so like being social I have another friend from elementary school who reached out to me just before Christmas and I was like honey I'm really busy I'd love to get together but that ain't happening anytime soon so I want to reach out to her and yeah, just like, there's, I've got, I just, I, I'm organized-ish, but I feel like I need to be more organized. So that's what we're going to work on uh, over the next couple days, hopefully, because uh, I feel like I'm doing all right. But also like my challenge for January was to go outside and be active and walk more. 
and now the challenge is over, but I still want to do that. So that's kind of something that like maybe make a goal of like go for six walks in a month. This Japanese thing, I'm really enjoying doing it. So I don't know if at the end of the month I'm going to want to be like, now nah, I'm over it. Eventually my goal, my like ultimate goal would be able to start taking the Japanese language proficiency tests. Number five, I believe is the first one you want to get down to one. <sighs> if you want to like, I don't ever have plans to like work and live in Japan where I would need it. But if you want to work for like a Japanese company, I think you need proficiency level one or two. But it would be cool to even just have five to be like, I took that test and I speak enough Japanese that I passed. <laughs> so yeah. Anyways, those are just random things and thoughts and plus there's just so much. There's so much. But I'm excited. I'm excited about things. I have this quote on my wall that was on my vision board that fell apart. And I finally like I officially made it fall apart. I just took everything off of it, but I kept the quote. And the quote says, every day is a hustle. Do I get tired? Yes. Do I give up? No. And so that's kind of like, I put it on my wall there, so hopefully I'll see it. Because yeah, I do get really tired, but I'm excited about these things. Like, I'm not doing anything that I'm not passionate about. And I think that's really cool. <laughs> It's been a long time, if ever, since I felt like this. So, with that confessional, I'm gonna go now because I really need to get to sleep. And with that, I wanna say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure, and I will see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.